Tired of paying for Microsoft Office? I mean, seriously, subscriptions, license fees, it never ends. But what if I told you there are free alternatives that work just as well? In today's video, I'm breaking down the five best completely free Microsoft Office alternatives you can start using right now. Whether you need to write documents, crunch numbers, or create stunning presentations, I've got you covered. Let's jump right into it. Number five is LibreOffice. First up, LibreOffice. It's the king of free office suites. You get a full package, word processor, spreadsheet editor, presentation maker, and it handles Microsoft files like a pro. Plus, it works offline, no internet needed. You get six different applications, writer for word processing, calc for spreadsheets, impress for presentations, draw for diagrams, base for databases, and math for formulas. It supports a huge range of file formats, including .docs, .xlsx, and .pptx, so you won't have compatibility issues when opening Microsoft Office documents. Pros Offline access Open source and regularly updated Highly customizable with extensions Cons The user interface is a bit more traditional not as modern as Microsoft 365. Collaboration features aren't as polished. Number 4 is Google Docs Second, Google Docs, Sheets, and Slides. If you love working online and collaborating with others in real time, Google Suite is unbeatable. And yes, it saves everything automatically. Real-time collaboration, automatic saving to Google Drive, commenting, suggesting modes, it's built for teamwork. You never have to worry about losing your work, it saves every few seconds automatically. Pros. Instant collaboration with teammates or friends. No installation required, just a browser. Tons of templates to speed up your work. Cons. Needs a good internet connection to work smoothly. Slight formatting differences when exporting to Word or PowerPoint. Number three is WPS Office Free. Next, WPS Office Free, if you want that Microsoft Office feel without the cost. WPS looks sleek, feels familiar, and opens all your Word, Excel, and PowerPoint files without a hiccup. Not only does it open and save Microsoft file formats perfectly, but it also offers a tab view meaning you can work on multiple documents inside a single window. The design is so close to Microsoft Office that most people feel right at home immediately. Pros Familiar UI similar to Microsoft Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. Built-in PDF converter and reader. Lightweight, perfect for slower machines. Cons. The free version shows occasional ads. Some advanced features are locked behind a premium subscription. Number three is only Office. Coming in strong only Office. This one's perfect for professionals and small teams who need a slick, modern office suite. It's a full-fledged office suite offering docs, sheets, and slides either through a web platform, desktop app, or even self-hosted solutions for businesses. You get a very clean, minimalist UI almost like a hybrid between Google Docs and Microsoft Word but with excellent offline editing. Pros Modern and beautiful interface Both cloud and offline editing available Open source for teams that want to self-host Cons Installation can be a little more technical if you want self-hosting. Some team collaboration features require setup. Number one is Free Office by SoftMaker. And finally, Free Office by SoftMaker, the perfect lightweight solution if you need fast performance without sacrificing compatibility. It's a free-to-use version of SoftMaker Office available for Windows, Mac OS, and Linux users. It includes TextMaker, PlanMaker, and presentations direct equivalents to Word, Excel, and PowerPoint. The performance is impressive documents open almost instantly, even on older hardware. Pros Super lightweight, great for older computers. Full compatibility with Microsoft Office formats. Clean, easy-to-use interface. Cons Some premium features like thesaurus or advanced export options are reserved for paid versions. Limited online collaboration features. No matter which one you choose, you're saving money without losing productivity. So, which one will you try first? Comment below and let's chat. And hey, if you found this video helpful, smash that like button, subscribe for more awesome tech content, and I'll see you in the next video.